At least 15 Palestinians, including three commanders of the militant group Islamic Jihad, have been killed in the Israeli airstrike on the Gaza Strip. In the last two days, 21 were killed. Israel said the Islamic Jihad leaders it targeted overnight were involved in recent attacks on Israeli civilians. Islamic Jihad has vowed revenge and Gaza-based militants are expected to respond with rocket fire into Israel. The extent of any escalation is likely to depend on whether Hamas, which controls Gaza, decides to join in. Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu said this country was prepared for all possibilities. The strikes were in the deadliest since three days of hostilities between Israeli and Islamic Jihad last August, in which 49 Palestinians were killed in Gaza. At least eight persons were killed and dozens injured after PTA protesters and police engaged in clashes in Peshawar in Khyber Pakhtunkhwa of Pakistan on Wednesday as tense mood gripped the country following the arrest of former President Minister, Prime Minister Imran Khan. Another 300 people were injured. A day earlier, the PTA chairman was taken into custody by the National Accountability Bureau, NAB, in the Al Khati Trust case. The move sparked violent protesters across the country with PTA protesters attacking cantonment areas in different cities. As protests continued for the second consecutive day in various cities, the situation in Peshawar has worsened after PTA support is stormed in the building of Radio Pakistan.